I'm going to show you guys the exact same strategy that gets Angela, one of our partnering agents out of Orlando, seven to nine high quality sellers per month, one just in August being a $1.5 million listing. We are going to cover the exact same offer that actually generated this $1.5 million listing, plus two bonus offers, and the same backend processes in place to make sure these sellers actually convert. So if you wanna see how you can generate more listing appointments for your real estate business, predictably, consistently, and quite literally on 90 to 94% autopilot, then keep watching. Alrighty, let's not waste anyone, uh, any time because it's getting a little bit dark here. So we all know that if you want to start generating high quality sellers every month, you have to start out by generating leads, right? And then building a backend system that actually automatically like funnels these leads down so that you're not, so you're only spending your time on the high quality ones. Like traditional marketing, like you have to generate leads, funnel them down. Like this works for really any acquisition channel. Um, we currently generate all of our leads, like top of the funnel leads for our partnering agents through Facebook and Instagram ads. It's super important to note, like super important. Like this is just a complete limiting belief. If you believe this online ads or social media ads do work. What's not working is your backend processes that you have in place, right? It actually took me a while to realize this as well until I had a call with a seven figure agent out of Miami, Florida that said this, it's not rocket science. The rocket science quote unquote is actually in the nurture and follow up and, 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 um, you know, conversion. So like last year I tripled my business because I had the domino effect from year one too, right? Yeah. So like I mentioned to you guys in the beginning of the video and probably in the title, uh, I want to show you guys my exclusive offers. So to, to generate leads, you obviously have to put an offer in front of someone's face, right? So the top three offers that we use are cash offer, home evaluation, and seller's guide. Now these are, these are proven. And, and what so many real estate agents think is like, my ads aren't working because they're not flashy. This, this, this guys, online leads, are they are not referrals like obviously like everyone knows that like referral and soi leads are the best possible leads you can get the caveat to online leads is that you can get unlimited of them whenever you want right because people love clicking on stuff people love clicking on real estate ads these do not need to be flashy these do not need to be crazy like very very simple ads like this and i'll blow them up here for you guys so you guys can like pause the video and take some inspiration obviously like don't copy them exactly like you had to add your own touches and stuff and but very, very organic, simple. Like we run a marketing agency for agents across the US, right? So our ads have to be like work for everyone. So they're very broad. Like we can duplicate them across any client we work with. You can get a little bit more tailored if you want. You can add your picture on there, stuff like that. But what's important to remember is like, guys, this is not the hard part. This isn't the hard part. People love clicking on stuff. Like that's the biggest complaint we get. The leads suck, the leads are so low quality because you had to generate so many, right? So that's the, that's the lead generation side of things. So like, this is just a really good funnel like example well i'm not an artist but hey just stick with me guys so it's a it's a good example to show you guys like how this process actually works and how the lead generation is is the actually the easiest part so when we run these ads right we get tons of leads tons hundreds of leads like you can get 400 to 55 585 leads for thousand dollars two thousand dollars like the leads are not the hard part right now obviously we do want to disqualify some leads like right off the bat especially if you're an agent and you're calling these leads yourself which i highly don't recommend and i'll get to that further in the video you want to be asking questions as soon as a lead clicks on your ad so my reason for wanting to sell i want to sell within asap three to six months six months plus and you can disqualify people when they click on six months plus or you can make that nine months plus you can disqualify people when they click on nine months plus or even you know a year plus um, the property address is, you know, city, state, everything. And then what that's going to do just by adding some very, very simple questions to your ad is actually going to disqualify roughly 80% of the people that click initially. So like you can really see here, guys, how like the lead quality is so low just by asking three simple questions. You can disqualify 80% of the people that click. Now, what a lot of real estate agents do is they take these leads, right? They take these leads and they start calling them. And what what they don't understand is that it takes six to eight phone calls to actually get in touch with one of these leads. You guys don't have the time. You, you guys have deals that are closer to the closing table. You guys aren't going to wake up ready to call these leads. It takes it takes three to four days of calling them morning and afternoon every single day that we notice to actually get on a phone call with one of these leads. Okay. So the, again, like we have a whole nother process here, 7.5% of these leads were actually able to book into an appointment, right? So this is not your job. This is not the real estate agent's job. What we, what we really advocate for is outsourcing that to, 
a $6 an hour, $3 an hour caller from the Philippines or Bangladesh, they can call these leads perfectly fine and set them to appointments for you. You meet with them in the morning, go over, hey, this is what you need to do. Let's make sure that we're getting better at this. You role play with them, you get them better. And they can easily book 7.5 to 10% of the leads that have been screened with questions into appointments onto your calendar. And that's where we're getting these seller, these seller deals at, okay? Now, what's really important to understand is that your follow-up and your nurture processes actually come into play here. So there's 7.5% we're able to convert initially, basically like instantly, like ASAP, uh, within the first initial like 30 days, okay? So those are gonna automatically be set to appointments, but there's 92.5% of these leads that haven't been booked into an appointment for whatever reason. And these are the leads that still need followed up and nurtured because they're not gonna get converted you know, to an appointment to a deal as quickly. These still need nurtured, and these are gonna be your very like broad campaigns, your SMS, your email blast. Um, but I'm just explaining like it's very important that we're still working these 92.5% obviously that didn't convert within the first 30 days because there's still a lot of opportunity there. And now what we advocate to do, like once we do get these leads that come in, <clears throat> these 7.5% that actually turn into appointments and booked appointments, this is how we're doing it. It is a very, very simple process. Again, you hire a $3, $6 an hour VA to, to make this call for you right here. Hello. Hi, I'm Luke for Jeff. Yeah. Hey, this is Mark with GZO Realty. How are you? I'm doing good and yourself. Good. I'm uh, responding to your inquiry on Facebook. I understand you're looking to purchase a home. Yes, in the near future. Okay, great. So which area are you looking in? Um, I was looking somewhere outside of Wilmington, uh, either the Concord area, Claymont, like I work in you kind of get the gist that person is just there to call and i like to call them like the heartbeat finder because these leads have such a low pickup rate and such a low just like interested rate like it, it's right here when i when i actually show you guys these numbers like these numbers are, are very accurate like we work with agents across the entire us like this is nationwide like numbers like we understand like some markets are obviously different like but if you're saying your market's different, it's probably not. Like, it's a very rare case, so it's really not an excuse. But you are eliminating about 80% of people when you ask questions on a lead form. You're going to be looking about, and this is over the, a 30-day period, guys. So over a 30-day period, you're going to be looking to get about 7.5% of those actual quality leads that we're calling quality leads that answered these questions to an appointment. And that's what this person is here doing. This person is the one vetting and actually setting that. So to show you the end of the conversation here. And this is what you should have someone in, in, in place doing. If you're a real estate agent, you need to be having someone like this that's calling through your list, that's calling through the, the deals that aren't as close to the closing table um, and, and setting them for you. Hey, Jeff, you there? Yes, I'm here. We've got Gina here. Gina, are you there? I am. Gina, Jeff is looking for his first home uh, outside of the Wilmington area. He works in Chester, so hopefully around that area, Concord, Claymont. Um, he's looking for a four bedroom, two and a half bath with a master suite, uh, ideally traditional style with a basement. He cares for his grandmother, so in-law suite would be like perfect, but you know, not necessary, but that'd be ideal. His price range right now is 250 to 310, and I was thinking you can help him out. Absolutely. Okay, best of luck. Thank you. How you doing, Jeff? I'm doing good. Boom, it's that easy. Out of 91 to 117 leads, again, it really depends on how good of a setter you have and how good your setter is, but they bring these seven to nine people out of these 455 clicks on your ad. We, we bring them down to 91 to 117, and then your caller brings them down to seven or nine. Imagine when you were doing online lead gen. Like you were probably calling all these 91, 117, you were trying to keep up with them. Like, no, you want to put a caller in place to do all that heavy lifting for you. And now you just narrowed 91 leads down to seven to nine people that you can put your focus on. And even at that point, you might send them out to a team or something. Like these are still cold leads. They're not going to be the easiest leads on the planet, right? So if you want to work your sphere and you just need to feed your team, this is also an amazing strategy. And what we notice is about a 20% close on these. So if you want to be getting an extra one to two deals per month, like this is a very, very realistic system that you can implement. Like don't even call, like don't even book a call with my team. Go try to implement this yourself so you can understand like the power of having a system like this that... Like you put money in and you make more money out. It's like a money printer, like when you achieve stuff like this. And, and that's what paid ads are. Like it's a joke, but that is literally what paid ads allows you to do. But you have to have a back end system in place, right? 
the ads are easy. You can go watch a YouTube video. I have YouTube videos on this channel right now that show you how to create ads. That's the easy part. The hard part is building this back-end system that doesn't let these leads slip through the cracks. And it is very difficult. It's time-consuming to build that system. But you're in business for a reason, right? Like you're in business to build systems, to, to, to grow your business. And that's what it takes. And so this is just a really good example. I, I really threw this together pretty quickly. Like I, I'm not an artist, but hopefully this helps you guys understand like a system that you need to have in place if you are going to do online leads. If you don't have a system like this and you're not interested in creating a system like this, do not try online leads. It's not going to work for you, right? Keep working your, your sphere. Keep working your inconsistent referrals. And, and unless you want to achieve predictability, you have to create a system like this. So those are the exact same offers and backend systems we use to send our partnering real estate agents about seven to nine high quality sellers per month. For Angela recently, that $1.5 million listing, uh, she's, she's in Orlando. The, the median home price is like three to 400K. So obviously that's not insanely common, but still it's a, it's a great example of if you have the right backend systems in place, how you can turn such a cheap lead into such a big commission check. Um, if you're an established realtor and you want to see if my company can possibly do the same for you, uh, we work primarily on a performance basis so we would have to see if it makes sense to partner with you there will be a link in the description to book a quick 15 to 20 minute call with either me or my team if you're an agency owner i've got a 30-day free trial to go high level in the description i'll send you any of my real estate snapshots that help me get these successful results for my clients like all the back end the sms the email all of the drip and follow-up campaigns all that nerdy stuff um, and you also get a one-on-one -on -one with me uh, if you're not interested in any of that stuff that's completely fine as well just keep consuming the free content and hopefully i can provide value to you uh, somewhere for free. Uh, if you did like the video, please consider liking, commenting, subscribing, or sharing. But that's all for me. Thank you. Uh, please leave some feedback down in the comments. That's really all I can ask for from you guys so I can keep providing better or good content. You know, we all got to start somewhere and pretty new to the content game. So everything helps. Thank you guys so much.